What's up guys, welcome back to another video. I don't know if you saw our last video, I hope you did, but I got a bunch of cool Hot Wheels. You can see them right there behind me. Let's go and start a new one. Got about an hour to burn before my haircut, so I think I'm gonna check that Dollar General that I've been waiting for a restock on, and then we'll hit a couple other dollar stores. Let's try this first. Nope, there's nothing here. It's more old stock. Bummer. That family dollar actually usually hits pretty well for me, but for the past few months, it's just hasn't. So let's see if they got the restock here. They did, it's probably an end case, but I'm already... Oh wait, oh, ooh, 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 they did. That's not the treasure hunt though. End case, just like I thought. I really want that Subaru treasure hunt. You think it's gonna be here? Mustang, Bel Air, Lolux, Batman, Here's the Supra. This is a good sign if this is here. We might find a treasure hunt. Zonda, NSX, Volvo Drift. Oh my god. Stop all. I believe this is the super for this case. Wouldn't that be cool? A couple Dollar General exclusives here. Alright guys, no treasure hunt. I guess we can only be so lucky. That's like six end cases of Dollar General we found without the treasure hunt, so I don't know if I'm late or if they're not coming in these boxes or what, but in any case, we're gonna take these cars with us and then move on to the next spot. While I was in there, some lady walked into the aisle and just stood there staring at me, so I don't know what her deal was, but it's always kind of awkward when you're standing there talking to yourself. I almost sometimes wish I had a camera and like my eyeball or something so I could just not have to look like a weirdo but in any case everybody goes home and watches youtube so i don't understand why it's so strange when someone is recording a video it makes no sense to me anyways no treasure hunt there it really is like the fifth or sixth time i've run into an end case fully stocked at dollar general i guess we're just gonna have to keep looking hopefully one day i find it but either i'm late or they're just not coming in guys we're gonna try this dollar general again they usually just have fantasies it's been months since they get a restock someone's got to come by the old fantasies so maybe it happened i don't know let's find out i don't understand i don't understand why there's no restock here just windmills for days all right, I asked the lady in there. She said the truck is all out, whatever that means. All the other stores got them, so I don't understand why this one doesn't, but we'll just keep checking back. I'm pretty much staying in my hunting area. There's so many places I can go. I could drive for two hours and still find stuff. Guys, if you really enjoy my videos, help me do this more and click that like button. I really appreciate all the people who are commenting all the time. It means the world to me. Not only do I get to find my favorite cars, but I get to share them with you. I'm addicted. I'm addicted to this. I'm addicted to buying. I'm addicted to Hot Wheels. We have an end case here too. We got stock pegs. We got stock pegs. Yep, yeah, looks like we hit another dud. Who is getting all these treasure hunts? Yeah, this is definitely an end case. Okay, we have the dud super treasure hunt right here. I'm not seeing any Subaru. No, no shortage of these guys though. I got a little excited there for a minute, but just not my luck with that Subaru treasure hunt. I feel like I need to go to every single Dollar General in a 20,000 mile radius until I find one because I know Dollar General keeps getting that case. I found some on the top shelf and I thought maybe that there was gonna be the treasure hunt up there, but I was wrong. So, all right, Family Dollar, Dollar Tree, and then Haircut, if I have time to go to Dollar Tree. It is right next door, so. 
I think I'm actually gonna stop at the CBS. I've been here before and they don't have Hot Wheels, but it might've just been that time, I don't know. I'm here, so. This thing's cool, but no Hot Wheels in here. I actually don't think I have time to stop at any other stores before my hair cuts, so in the next scene, I'm gonna be nice and fresh. The Dollar Tree is right next to my barber. No Hot Wheels at all. All right, guys, the haircut is complete. We're looking fresh. I'm going to stop at that family dollar down the street, see if they got something. This store has been an L for the past three times I've been here, but I think they probably got one by now. Well, they did, I think, but I'm potentially too late. There's the CRX, Quattro, Porsche. I know, could have been a Super, but it's not. Huayra. I don't think too later. This is just uh, pushing Z sick. Oof. Nothing. No treasure hunt. Are we on? GK, so it'd be rising clock. No rise and climb here. Too bad I have all these because there's a bunch of cool cars here. Okay, you got all the coolest cars right up front for the next collector. So the only problem with being a hunter and making two, three, sometimes four videos a week is when I run into old cases, which seems to be pretty often now, I already have everything. I mean, I guess that's normal. There was a point where I wasn't hunting like crazy and running into something like that would have been pretty cool. So hopefully that makes someone else happy because there's some cool cars in there. You know, you could buy doubles and stuff just to get your fix, but come on. Do you really... Is that a good idea? I don't know. I don't know. Probably not. I put up a poll, I think about two weeks ago, asking you guys how often you want a video. You all said every day. I don't want to hit you with so many videos that you feel like you don't have time to watch them. So, I'm probably going to try to stick to it every two-day schedule and maybe on Saturday, Sunday. Because, you know, I really like releasing them, but if they're coming on too frequently, then I don't want people to be missing anything. Plus, I think it's smart to give the other videos some time to breathe, you know. Another Dollar General. It doesn't look like there's anything here either. Unfortunately, a couple Dollar General exclusives. Jamera. That doesn't look like much has changed since the last time we were here. So I think that is probably the end of the video. Let's go home and see what we got. Alright guys, it wasn't the best hunt ever, but we left with some Hot Wheels and that is better than not leaving with Hot Wheels at all. So let's see what we got here. We got a Lotus Sport Elise in yellow. I don't think I have very many of these and I actually don't think I have one opened. So I kind of wish I bought two, but in any case, I can add it to my collection now. We got another one of these Lay and Low Riders. I think I bought two in one of the other videos and I gave one to my neighbor, so I now have a replacement for that. And I went ahead and bought two more of the Toyota Supras. I have one open, one or two in my collection, but hey, they were there, so why not? I hope you guys enjoyed watching today's video. If you did, as always, don't forget to like, don't forget to subscribe, and I will see you in the next one. Later.